Is this this is the latest model you guys have, right? Yeah, we just oh. unveiled this yesterday. It's the race edition of the Eclipse 2.0, which has yeah, been out for a year or two. I noticed someone said they wanted to get an Eclipse, but they're waiting for the second version to come out. So I don't know what version they're waiting for. So I guess it's this version I think here. I like a little birdie must have told him that this was coming out. Right, yeah. exactly. That's probably me. Uh -huh. <laughs> but yeah, this is it. This is, uh, this nice. is the new one. As the changes being, of course, floating disc brakes. Uh -huh. We've got two piston caliper, two piston caliper. The motor used to hang down. To right, exactly, feet. exactly. That's now been tucked up into the frame. Nice. This comes with the carbon wheels as standard. Uh, They're usually a $1,700 option, but this comes with it. Yeah, I know I used to hear most of the gripe was that this was hanging too low and that it was on the swaying arm. It's still on the swaying arm, but you don't you don't think there's a problem with that at all? Well, what people don't know is this is actually like an inch thick. So uh, the motor is inside two in, uh, an inch thick of metal. Uh, I take it off-roading all the time and hit, hit this on rocks, hit this on, you know, all sorts of off-road stuff. And it's absolutely fine. We just did it to sort of like say, okay, yeah, we've, we've solved the problem now. Uh, but it wasn't really a problem to begin with. Okay. And um, how much does this one retail for? This is going to retail for about 6 eight. Six eight. And it comes out at the end of this month, beginning of July. And it's a 72 volt, right? 72 volt standard, 70 mile an hour out the box, uh, 60 to 70 mile range. Yeah. Wow. So fully Those rotating. are the words people want to hear. Yeah. This is fast, out of the box. Yeah. I appreciate you. Thank okay. you.